Okay, now in this little demo, we're going to show you how to synchronize your lessons that you've downloaded onto an iPad. So what you need to do first is load up iTunes and then go to the file menu. So the file menu at the top of the screen and select add to library. And so the add to library dialog box will pop up. These are some of the uh, lessons in the Algebra 1 course, and you can see they're all MP4 files. And just select one or select all of them, whatever, however many you want to transfer, just select that. For this particular case, I'll just select this guy here, click open, and you can see a little dialog window. What's happening here is iTunes is adding this, uh, or the lessons, to the iTunes library. So if you go over to Movies, which is where we're at right now, you'll notice that there's an Algebra 1 Tutor Volume 2, and you could click it and get the rest of the title information. So this is one of the items that's been added to the iTunes library. Here's another one, along with a bunch of other movies that I have. So basically they're, they're added into the library there. Now the screenshot, uh, you know, for this video looks a little weird. That's just iTunes doing its thing. It's going to play just fine when you actually synchronize it. So it's it's in the iTunes library. We still need to add it to the iPad. So we're going to go ahead and click on your iPad. Once you plug it in, you should see your device on the left-hand side. So we're going to click that. Now you're controlling your synchronization settings for your iPad. So you want to click on Movies. These are all the movies that you just saw in my iTunes library. And here is that lesson that we just added. You want to put a check mark there to synchronize that movie and any other one you want. You can see, you can scroll down here and see that I have another one here, for instance, that I've added uh, earlier and so on. So just go ahead and select the ones that you want to actually transfer to your iPad. Basically, whatever you check here is going to be copied over to the iPad. And then hit Apply. And then you notice iTunes is doing its thing, waiting to sync. It's going to back up your iPad and synchronize. And what's going to happen is these videos are going to be then transferred to your iPad. So then once the backup and synchronization is complete, open your iPad, go to the Videos app, and in there you will see this listed among all the other movies that you have in your iPad, and then you can just tap to play. When you like to remove it from your iPad, uh, all you have to do, you can delete it from your iPad if you want, or you can just come in here once it's plugged in like this, uncheck this box, click synchronize, and then it'll just delete it from your iPad. So it's a pretty painless process. Basically, you have to go file, add it to the library. Once it's in the library, then you go to your iPad, movies tab, and select everything that you like to be copied over.